It's Mickey from Neo39. Couple more days left on the job, but I bring you the Woodson. Actually, the Air Max pillar, but you know it from Charles Woodson, University of Michigan, Heisman Trophy winner. Can you go wrong? No, you can't, so let's start. All right, check this out. We got Varsity Maze and Navy on the outsole. We got Visible Air with Navy on the inside, and then it carries over in the forefoot where we have that maze going over in the toe cap with a hit of that Navy. As you go up to the midfoot, more maze, hits the Navy again, and on your upper, you're definitely using much more of a navy color blocking with the maize swoosh and then the hits going throughout. We have a 3M cage here which provides reflectivity. If you get the shoe, take a picture with a flash, you'll see what I'm talking about. And then you have inserts of navy mesh throughout along with your yellow hit stars. As you look at the toe cap, you got navy leather with minimal micro perforation. And then you have a leather ice stay with the leather rope laces, once again with that mesh. And then your piping is all suede in that navy. You've got to love that. As you go up to the tongue, of course, you have a tongue tab right here with the air branded along with the swoosh in yellow. And the tongue gives you a diamond center point, fresh to death. Here's a quick shot of your medial for you. Obviously devoid of the mesh that we saw earlier, as well as the 3M and the hits of maize throughout. Just a lot more simple and clean on this end. As you look inside the shoe, you can see you have a maize footbed along with the TL Air branding. And then you can see that piping I was talking about earlier creeps into the lining, giving you that navy suede lying very fresh and lush. You don't see that on a lot of shoes. That's what I'm really loving about that. And that carries over on the inner booty as well. You've got that suede right there. You got some rubber in the maze. And then you have the heel tab in navy with 3M hits all throughout. So once again, giving you that reflectivity, particularly at nighttime. As you move alongside down, you can see the TL Air branding right there in plastic. Carry it over, got more of that yellow. Here's that visible air once again. And as you look at the sole, you got navy along with yellow. And then there's your TL Air branding once again. Simple and clean. Everybody who's been following me for a long time knows I'm a hardcore trainer guy. I love cross trainers. This one is definitely one of the ones in the mix of the collection you want to hold on to. I don't think you will be seeing many retros in years to come from Nike from this. Obviously, there will be other colorways this year, but you want to hold on to this because this is special. You got that UM colorway, fresh to death. Anyhow, thanks for stopping in. A couple more days left. I'm trying to give you guys as many videos as I can before I leave. Keep on the lookout Wednesday. Gonna give you the new blog address as well as the YouTube address. This is Mickey. Catch you later.